and welcome back to the Sims 3 Perfect Genetics Challenge. So, like I said, I was going to play Sunday off camera unless something were to happen. Well, I went ahead and let him purchase a lottery ticket and you freaking guys, he won 100,000 simoleons from the lottery. Like, are you kidding? I never, look at, oh my god, look at the dance. Look at that dance. Oh my gosh. So now we have 100,000 simoleons just do whatever we want with, which is pretty freaking awesome. And what I kind of want him to do is purchase some more scraps. Since we have all that money, we're going to purchase um, a couple hundred, I believe. And he also leveled up. So he is now not leveled up not not work leveled up uh he leveled up the inventing so he's a level five i believe yeah so he's level five inventing and he learned how to make this little drinking llama and then this little improved smasher so he did learn a couple of things while we were just kind of you know getting some things done around the house and we went ahead and taught him to talk and now we're gonna get little dude to learn to walk he's actually hungry but i want him to learn to walk and then all we have to worry about is potty training so that won't be a problem i love how both the both of them got the want to quit work after they won the lottery like girl me too but you're not gonna do it so we're just gonna have to deal okay okay so why don't you clean up your plates and use the bathroom and it's freaking nasty outside it's been pouring all freaking sunday but i love that their house like you just look outside and you can see the lighthouse it's so beautiful you guys so what i'm gonna do is have him Oh my gosh, I'm adjusting in my chair because my foot is asleep. I'm going to have him make a widget because he does want to make a few of them. So let's do, which one was it? The drinking llama, I think, is the one that he just learned. Yes, so we're going to sell these. And he needs 54 simoleons. So I just want to make sure those are actually going towards his, his little situation. Okay. So she's just kind of watching TV and being a bum, and he is pretty hungry, so let me just see if we can get him to learn to walk, and then we will go ahead and put him in his little high chair, because I ended up purchasing one and just, I sold the stuff that was in here because I will never use it, so I just put a little high chair in there so we can feed him some food. Oh, he just like bumped straight into the couch. What a cutie. Okay, yay! All right, so now he knows how to walk and talk, but come over here. And Mama Bear, why don't you come over here and pick Dakota up? We are not quitting our work, honey, okay? Like, we're not. That's just not gonna happen. Ooh, the improved drinking llama. Okay, go ahead and put Dakota, Dakota in the high chair. Oh, my foot is, like, dead asleep, you guys. It hurts. It hurts. Let's serve him up some eggs and it looks like he's gonna be going to bed uh you want to see him age up well okay let me see here oh my gosh i don't want to get rid of any of them but i would prefer for him to see his son age up well obviously all right so she's gonna make him some food and let's go ahead and sell this guy for eight simoleons wait did we not purchase scrap i could have swore let me try that again purchase scrap a hundred. Why does it only say 14? I'm so confused. So we're losing the money, but we're not getting scrap? What the heck? I don't understand. That's weird. That might be a little glitch, but that's going to really aggravate me. So we're going to let her go to the bathroom, and then I don't think he actually needs to go to bed. So we'll probably just let him out of his high chair and he kind of he can kind of do whatever he wants to. Maybe he can come over here and play with this little guy or his toys or something. Oh, she wants to kiss Reed. How cute. Oh, he's taking a nap. Dude, go to sleep. Don't nap. Or should we have him? No, I don't want to do babies back to back, but I kind of want him to do a risky woohoo. Like, I think I kind of want him to do a risky woohoo. I'm not going to lie. Uh, So why don't you come over here? Pick him up and let him out. Come on, I know, you poor little baby, I know. Girl, don't go to bed, what are you doing? 
He just ate, and you're gonna serve him food? Like, seriously? Alright, let's just do it. Let's just do a risky woohoo. You never know. You never know, because... I don't want to have that many babies, but at the same time, I don't know how long it's going to take, so I don't know if I should if I should just try for a baby or not. I don't know. We'll see. He's going to go play with his toys, and then they're going to go to sleep, so I'm going to let them do their little risky woohoo, go to sleep, and I will pick up when somebody wakes right, guys, up, guys. So we are back, and we're putting... A <laughs> Look at this face. I am literally dying. Look at this face. This is cute, but actually kind of creepy at the same time. But we're putting him to sleep because he is tired, and um, what is this? Cleaning camp chemical res residue and, bot bleh, and botanical blobs off the lab dishes wasn't easy oh because she had washed those dishes that one time okay so she is at work right now and we're gonna have her begin to meet her fellow scientists and she wants to get a promotion will she in this part <gasps> she will get a promotion so that is awesome he is gonna eat some leftovers we're gonna let him get himself ready he has not taken a shower and we're going to well we're gonna let him eat first because i know if i hit the shower he will stop eating. So, Vaughn Knight's co-worker Susan Wainwright needs a test, su test subject for a new substance that was created. Does Vaughn Knight want to participate in a free sampling test? Sure, let's just do it. Drinking that mislabeled liquid seems to have affected Vaughn, but don't worry, it's not contagious. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is this? Itchy. There's no way to scratch that cursed itch. Yuck. Okay, maybe we shouldn't have done that. Poor girl. Uh, we're going to go ahead and let you take a shower. Oh, also, she is not pregnant from the uh, risky woohoo. I went ahead and checked. So, she is not pregnant. So, I think we will probably try for a baby before I end this part because I don't know how many children we're going to have to have. So, I think I could handle like three kids at a time and that would be about it. So, we'll try to do... We'll try to do, like, if the next baby isn't, maybe I'll do another one, and then we'll wait a little bit until they're aged up. But I think I could handle three kids at a time. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But I'm still kind of confused why we don't have any scrap, even though we purchased it and we lost the money for it. So let me just try one more time. Let's see what happens. Yeah, we're not, we're not gaining scrap. We're losing money, but we're not gaining scrap. So I don't understand why it is doing that but what is wrong with you honey oh he's hungry okay well what i'm gonna do since we don't have any scrap is go to the junkyard and see if there's anything over here and we'll just have to call a babysitter for uh for dakota because we don't have any scrap and there's nothing we can do really so okay we can't dig through that pile so that's what we're gonna have to do it really sucks i need to see if i can find a junkyard that has a little bit more piles, you know, because these two piles is not, it's, it's not working out. Uh, go ahead and geek out with your fellow scientists and then maybe we will let you kind of go out or something with them. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. We don't really know. Let's see. So we've got, is this Boyd? Yes, we got Boyd, Wainwright, Susan, Wainwright, Judy Bunch, and Fiona McIrish. So it would be kind of fun if we went out with our boss or something. We could always just like get a drink or something. So we're going to call the babysitter. And I don't think that, yeah, we can't even dig in these, but we'll see how it goes. All right, he's just about here. There we go. There we go. Hopefully we'll be able to find some. I'm just, I don't understand that. That is just, that's just so weird. Yeah, I don't know. I might have to like reset the town or I have no idea why why we wouldn't be able to purchase it. So we just lost like a couple thousand dollars. No big deal. It is not a big deal at all because <laughs> we are made of money now apparently. Which will come in handy because I don't want to stay in that house forever, obviously. There's not enough room, but unless we don't have to have that many children because if we, you know, the next time we get a freaking perfect genetic baby then we can stay in that house until till we want to so we shall see all right so she wants to earn a raise and i'm gonna go ahead and lock that in because she is gonna get a promotion which usually you get a raise to we've reed found a two-ton table who would throw that away what we found a table maybe it's in our inventory i'll have to look and see that's really strange but I also want her to maybe, I was going to say throw a party, but that's not what we're going to do. We're going to see if we can invite our coworkers out or something and maybe, maybe get a drink after work before she heads home. 
going to be? Can we just buy it? Let's see. I want hey. Susan Wainwright looks like she's super cute, but I kind of want to get on our boss's good side. So, do we not get our promotion? We should. There we go. I was going to say we should. Congratulations, Bond's impressive performance has earned her a promotion to lab tech as well as a bonus of 528 simoleons. Your commitment to the less than glamorous side of science has garnered you a position as a lab tech. It's time to earn that lab coat and broaden your horizons. Beware of flamm flammable materials, radioactive mutagens, and self-aware robotics as you progress deeper into the workings of the laboratory. So she works 9 a.m. to 2.30 p.m which is i think what she worked originally oh look at this little puppy <gasps> look at this little puppy can we take you home look at your hair it is so funny looking look at the hair on your head oh my god i'm losing my mind hey. oh, he's like oh hey a puppy that's exactly how i am is this someone's hey. dog or can we like take it because you are super freaking cute oh it makes me want to get a dog now maybe we'll have to adopt a dog i'll have to look and see He's, he seems like he's finding a, a good amount of stuff. Okay. So, that babysitter's gonna have to come back. Now, after he gets home, then we will go out on the town. Oh, can we have you? Maybe we will look and see if we can have a dog. I really kind of want a dog. Alright, hurry up, my friend. How many things have you found? This is a pretty big pile. It's always one of the piles that we cannot dig through. Okay, there's like a bunch of people coming to the junkyard for some reason. Uh, let's see. Who do we got here? We got VJ Alvi, Styles McGraw, Iqbal Alvi. So the whole Alvi family. Yep, the whole Alvi family is here for some strange reason. Okay. Are you taking care of your son? Feet on floor. For being a dislikes children, you um are actually... You're actually being pretty helpful, so that is great. I'm going to come over here, and I kind of want to see what this table is, like if there's actually a table that we got in our inventory, because that was kind of weird. Oh, we did! We're just going to sell it. It's just like a little end table. Okay, I didn't know you could find stuff like that, but that's fine with me. Okay, so we're going to have her come over here and potty train Dakota. Um, my fellow clerks. No, we're not going on a date. Are you serious? No. We're going to potty train him and then we're going to call and see if our coworker wants to go out. Her outfit absolutely kills me. Go ahead and take a shower because you stink from digging in the trash and then go ahead and pay all of the bills. She wants to go to the bookstore for some reason, but we're not going to we're not going to do that. Is she a bookworm? Oh, she is a bookworm. I'm not used to having bookworm sims. I, I rarely ever have that as a as a trait. That's why she wants to go to the bookstore. But we're not going to uh, improve handiness skill. We can probably do that. You need to get out of this outfit because I am so tired of looking at it. Get into your everyday wear, please. Because this is just... It ain't cute, my friend. It ain't cute. So you need to come over here and mop up the puddle. Empty this out. Clean up. You're the neat sim, so why don't you do that? And then we're going to see if we can invite our boss out and have a drink. We could just go right next door. But I don't know if I fix Mixed Masters karaoke to have, like, a professional bar. So I'm not going to risk it. we got Reavers, Bubble Bath, Alma, Almaya. Let's go to Bubble Bath because that makes me think of Spongebob, so... <laughs> Anything that reminds me of Spongebob must be good. So let's do that. And we're going to change his outfit so that he's in his um, everyday wear as well. Alright, oh cool, she's going to meet us there. So we're going to go have a drink and then we're going to come home and we're going to try for a baby with our husband. Yes, we are. We won't be out too, too long because it is late and she's tired and has work in 50 hours but I do want her to just kind of go out because she did want to go out on the town and stuff so we'll let her have a night out with her boss and see if we can kind of befriend her because we don't have any sort of relationship with her at all or any of our co-workers for that matter oh we need to take care of our garden I just I just saw that as we passed I might have to reset the town to see if we'll be able to get um get some scrap or if that's just a problem but I'm really, really bothered by that because I'm like, oh, now we have money to purchase scrap. Uh, just kidding. <laughs> we have the money, but it's not going to allow us to. We are not watching a raccoon. She's actually hungry, too, and smells bad. I don't think she took a shower before work, so 
Oopsie. Okay, are we here yet? Who is this? Oh, paparazzi. Okay. Here's our boss. Oh, she's hungry too. So maybe we can... can we... We got money, so, oh, it's a hot spot. Maybe we can buy a group meal and, you know, take our boss out to dinner. That sounds nice. Who's this guy? Simis, Simis Bachelor. He's the rich guy, I do believe. Um, oh, we're gonna be chatted too. Okay. Be like, hey girl, you wanna give us a raise? <laughs> wanna give us a promotion? Let's just kind of talk to her a little bit. Get to know her, see see what her life is like, ask her if she's single. Why is it so loud? Why was that so loud? Uh let's see. Order food. A group oh this bitch. This bitch better give us a raise. We're gonna go with the pizza. The eighty dollar pizza, mind you. Because I want her to be able to eat too. We're just throwing our money around, you know, like we, we know, you know, we just won the lottery, so we're just tossing it around and having a. Have, oops, I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to actually click in that, but that's okay. We're here now. Okay, you're doing good. He's doing good. He's putting him in the playpen. All right, so we're not trying to like hook up with you or anything, but she wants to order bar food, and I'm gonna go have him come over and invent some items while we're waiting. We've only got 72 scraps, so we're not gonna be able to do too much. So come over here. What in the world? How is that Mixed Masters karaoke? Like, what in the heck? I feel like there's a glitch or something. Uh, go ahead and invent and then make a widget because you want to the smasher. Who do you want to make? Okay, you only made two. I might have to delete that scrap a bench thingy maybe there's a glitch with that or something because that was really weird i wasn't even on mix master karaoke and it was saying that that's weird but we're gonna make or we're gonna order a little bit of food she is literally me at every place ever like can you please get out of my face? Like, are you trying to butt in front of me? Because, bitch, that's not going to work. Like, her face just shows it all. Girl, I know. She's like, this bitch is in my way. Okay, well, we're going to try one more time. We're going to order a group serving of pizza. Stamping her foot. All of them are. Well, you know, we're trying to buy you some food, Fiona, but all these bitches want to get in the way. Give me a burger. I'm going to steal it. <laughs> keeps getting really weird and loud but I don't like it okay you better order that pizza and I kind of wanted to see if we can have a dog I forgot about that I really want to adopt a dog there is like oh, sorry guys there is something on my mouse and my freaking mouse will not move okay I forgot to water these guys so we'll do that Hopefully hello to make something. Actually, I just want you to make that um, one toy. Okay, are we getting the pizza? Is she grabbing a slice? Awesome. Okay, you need to be careful because you really scare me the way you just like start hammering stuff and you don't even, you're not even careful about it. Like, I don't have time to take you to the hospital, okay? All right, so he's going to do that and let's see. Is she going to, hopefully Fiona is grabbing a slice. Of, did everybody leave? Oh, she's over here. Like, come on! Like, can we bring a serving to Fiona? Come on, that's that's what we got. She's gonna sit down and order her own damn food. No, she's gonna read a book. Okay. All right. So we made the smasher. Go take a piece of pizza to your boss. Like, for some reason, she decided to come to the. <laughs> she decided to come to the bar and read a book. So, I mean. She's like, I love how she's just literally holding it like here. Here, take this pizza. Take it. Take it. Oh god. Oh god. I'm doing this all wrong. <laughs> I hate when I do that. I thought I was on her, but I apparently was not. She's like, here, take this slice of pizza. Take it. <laughs> she's like, okay, um, I'm gonna go sit down now. Alright, I'm gonna have her have one drink and then come home. Have the pink bunny because that sounds pretty freaking good. He's going to eat and then we're going to get that woo hooty action on because I want to see if we can 
have a baby and then let's see how that goes. Didn't I tell you to like mop this up a long time ago? He does not listen to anything I say. He wants, she wants to buy a dryer. Well, we really don't have the space for that. We've got a clothesline. Oh my god, did you break this? He did. Somebody did. I don't know if it was him, but somebody broke it. Oh my gosh, it's 11.30 already. We need to put our little dude to bed. Dakota is tired. Go ahead and put him in the crib. And she's drinking her drink. We're not going to buy a dryer, even though you got some monies. Okay, we ordered bar food, but whatever. Come home. We're going to woohoo with our husband. So, yeah. Just to deal with it. Spooky days in just a couple days. <gasps> Ooh, we'll have to go get some um, pumpkins because I really would like to carve pumpkins. I think that would be really fun. She is in such a bad mood. Maybe we'll do a shower try for a baby since she's dirty. So, we, you know, like, kill two birds with one stone. You better not do anything other than mop this up because if you go to bed before she gets here. Okay, I was going to say, you better not do it. All right, let's go ahead and try for a baby one more time. And we'll see if we can hear the noise. And I've been writing down, I have a little notebook. I tell you guys this all the time, but I have a little notebook and it has all the baby names you guys are leaving me. So you can continue to leave them because if I don't use them for this Let's Play, I will surely need them for the A to Z baby challenge and other Let's Plays. So... I like to keep those in mind because you guys can give some really, really interesting ones that I don't even think of. And I love it because I'm like, ooh, that's where I can get some new names. Because I always tend to use the same ones whenever I play. All right, here we go. Here we go. We're going to get all close and personal. Sorry. <laughs> you got to listen for the noise. Come on. Be pregnant. Be pregnant. <laughs> yes oh my goodness okay so baby number two is headed on the way and he broke the damn shower oh my god we're gonna have to call somebody to repair the entire damn house because he's going to break everything so on that note look at how cute she is like oh i love her i'm gonna probably make it so that she can work during her pregnancy just because I do want her to continue to work and, you know, it's really not, we don't need as many days off. So I'll just go in NROS and make sure that she does work while she's pregnant. So yeah, leave a like on this video. If you guys are enjoying it, leave those baby names in the comments down below. Subscribe before you go if you've not already. Turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when I upload, which is every single day except for Sunday. And as usual, I love you all so very much and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye guys.